Okay, here we are. Got ourselves a new toy. Actually, it's my new set of hands. Um, got ourselves an LX2610. This is a crossover tractor between um, the B series and the L series. That's what the X stands for. So you can get the B2650 or um, 3350, I think is what it is. Or a 2501, 3301, and this is the crossover. It's 26 horse. The 10 is like the production model or whatever. The LX is the crossover series number. So this is a 26 horsepower. It's diesel. It's a very nice tractor. We got the grapple hook. Um, this is a work saver, grizzly something or other grapple because we have a lot of woods and logs and stuff we've got to move. We also got a bucket that goes with it, but uh, we've put about three hours on it so far. So far so good. Everything's looking nice. This is um, taller than ones you might see on the dealership unless they've got the R4 tires on here, which we went with. Um, these are filled rear tires, R4s on the front as well. But uh, yeah, this is it. This is the Brand new 2020 LX2610. So far, so good. It's been running great. It's a big tractor. Um, out of the first few hours, I've been learning how to use the grapple and all that kind of stuff. Um, so far, I don't have any complaints. But I will tell you that um, power for this is, is decent. It's not a huge tractor. It's not a small subcompact. This is still classified as a compact tractor. It's got a category one um, setup in the back here. Everything looks nice. We don't have any rear attachments uh, at the moment, so I'm not too concerned about that. Even when we do, it may just be a rake. The little ball hook, the uh, ball hitch there is something I added myself just for fun. Uh, we mostly use it for this, and I will tell you, you got to learn how to use this, which is what most of my hours, my hours have been, um, is learning how to use the grapple, because the weight will offset the the tractor. So you've got to be real careful, even on slightly uneven ground. If you've got too much hanging off one end, and you happen to go up a slope just right, and by slope I don't mean like a ditch. I'm talking like just a slight incline, some uneven ground, you will um, take that back tire off the ground. Even though these are weighted, I do not have a ballast box on, or a weight system on the back. So grapples are scary stuff, especially if you start trying to get it up in the air. And uh, we have a lot of pine tree tops that are interweaved with each other because of the loggers that we had come in. So um, it's taking a little bit more time than I like. But, this is definitely faster than doing it by hand. Um, so, you will see more videos on the tractor and selecting a tractor and all that good stuff uh, coming shortly. This is just kind of my little intro into the new toy. Alright. Pretty nice. So that's what we had. We still have it. That's our dedicated mowing machine now. And that's what we're currently using. <laughs> All right. Well, on to the next.